right, we're starting to get rained on here in the Colorado mountains. <laughs> and it's a little cold. We're heading towards Leadville. Uh, this is uh, day two on the way back from Sturgis. Uh, highway, or uh, I guess Interstate 70 over to Grand Junction was uh, closed for about, I don't know, 20, 30 miles. Uh, so we're actually cutting through the Colorado Rockies to get to Bluff, Utah for tonight's hotel. Uh, we're probably not going to get there till 7, 8 o'clock at night. Somehow we managed to always be running late or have something to delay us on this trip, but it's all an adventure. Last night we got in, what was it, 8 o'clock, bearded? Yeah, it was like 8, eight o'clock, so we didn't go down to that lake, but we found a nice little uh, cafe pub uh, to have dinner at, and then go kick back and rest after an eight-hour day or ten-hour day. Um, was a little adventurous. I ran into Indian Rider Radio on our first gas stop, and then proceeded. Yeah, in Wyoming. I, I don't remember where it was in Wyoming. I got a picture on Instagram of that, and then. Kept going down through Wyoming, got blasted by some really heavy winds, uh, which I did, it wasn't too bad. I've been through worse. Um, stopped uh, <laughs> to eat. Uh, I won't even say where it is. If you go to Instagram, you can see where we had to walk to the door, order the food. They brought it out. The patio was closed, so we started eating on the patio wall, which is about table height. And then the manager came out and said we couldn't even eat there. So we went and sat down by the bikes and ate at the bikes, which sort of sucked. I mean, I don't think it's that bad to eat away from everyone else on a patio wall. And proceeded to uh, get down to Dillon, Colorado, but on the way, I've already blown this fork seal down here. Uh, my little rag fell off. You can probably see the fork oil building up. Which I gotta put another rag on it or I'll get over the bike again. And then had the wonderful experience of feeling something hit my boot down there. Uh, while we're going about what, 65, 70 down the freeway, and as soon as I felt something hit the boot, I looked down to see what it was, and then I noticed that my uh, shifter here, um, it unscrewed on the inside. You could see scrapes down there on it, and it came off. And the shifting rod held it on. So I pulled over real quick, uh, thanks to Dirty D's to have a right size Allen wrench. Pulled the whole peg assembly off to screw that back in. And uh, you can't see the zip ties there. And I proceeded to put the zip ties through it to keep the bolt from backing off. And then uh, did the same thing to the other side and checked it. So uh, right now, the bolts are like little hollow bolts. There's zip ties in them to make sure that they don't loosen up and uh, come out on me again. So I don't have to deal with that. Um, all of it's part of taking long trips where something's going to break. So it's all good. Yeah, I'll be a popsicle by the end of the day maybe. Well actually uh, <laughs> going to end up uh, getting a little cold here for probably most of the day and then drop down into Utah and then it's going to get hot. So I'll go from like, I don't know, 50 degrees or so to, uh, oh, it's only 59? Oh. Yeah, it's only 59 right now, but the wind is cold and I just got this uh, line <laughs> uh, flannel on, which isn't perfect, but it's doable. So. Oh, yeah, we also have Oki Dix's jacket that uh, he left at the house, so that's my backup plan. Uh, we would have got a better start today, except for uh, right here was probably like under 40 degrees in the morning. And maybe high 30s or something like that, so we sort of dragged our ass out of the hotel. And so, that way it could be a little bit warmer through here, but I'm sure we'll be fine, we'll make it. There's a lot of stuff to see here, so... <laughs> All right, time for some adventure. Oh, it's cold back there. I'm over here sunbathing now. 
So we just got rained on a little bit ago and it got cold and not much rain, but now we're in the sun. I'm gonna play lizard and sit out in the sun right now. And once we get around this corner, you guys can see some of the uh, huge mountains up here. We're almost down to 24. Because when I turn the camera on, I can't see shit. Get gas here. I'm good. I'm only 33. Where those mountains go? I want to show them the mountains. Look at this nice blue sky for us. Oh, they're back there. Missed it. Oh, hopefully, hopefully it's more like this all day. I was getting a little cold back there, but not cold enough to borrow Oki's jacket or didn't rain enough to put our rain gear on. Where are we at? Ooh, nice red. Gotta watch out for those holes. A thousand feet work ahead. Strictly a forest. Drake and RV detour. What'd you do? Oh, turn only? Oh. Uh, thanks, Fire Resco. Vaping? Yeah. Boing. Come on. Oh, this was bad over here. It's so bad here they got cops out all over. No. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's the hills over there with a little rain on them. It's snow. It's hard to turn that way sometimes. Hopefully you guys saw that. That was a quickie. I gave you guys a quickie. Not that type of quickie, you plus. Look at that old building. So unfortunately I didn't have my camera rolling when we rolled by the Bates Motel a little while ago. I'm telling you, when we do these trips, we need a, fa uh, a camera crew so we could just ride and make bad comments. And they can just pick, film everything and pick everything out. Maybe someday we'll get that uh, sponsorship or people willing to help us with these filming of these trips. Make like, make like a little movie. Yeah, look at this place. I'm not sure where we're at yet. I don't think this is, if this is Leadville, it's a different direction than I came in when I came up here before. Golden Burrow Cafe, nice. Look at this place. Sweet. town. Got that old school feel. Oh, Leadville. Yeah. Well, this is the way it came out before. I think, yeah. It just looks different. Leadville's legendary saloon, 1879. That was the saloon I was telling you about. Yeah. Wild Bills. Wild Bills Hamburgers. And that was Leadville. Yeah, I seen Dumb and Dumber. What are you, what are you getting at? Hopefully we won't be frozen like that. It's not running out of our nose, frozen. It's a little nicer over here, it's not as cold. Yep. Wow, how'd you like to live out here? What was it, granite? Right next to this river. Sage Cafe. Ice cream breakfast with lunch. Go across the bridge. <laughs> yeah, 
Wait till winter. It gets cold here. <laughs> I didn't do it quite right. <laughs> That was better take. Oh, over here. Right in the middle of nowhere. Sort of. Or somewhere. In Colorado. Look at this action shot. Action shot walking in the middle of the street. <laughs> I don't mess with them. We got a one lane road here, so we gotta wait a little bit. So I said, what the hell, let's stand in the street. Still in South Fork. I gotta turn him down, jeez. All right, I'm just screwing around. This place is pretty cool. Come on. Oh, here comes cars. Well, that's more than the car. It's windy over here. Well, that's a good shot. Uh, I think I'll go climb that. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Maybe they're going to let us through here in a few minutes. Let's play Frogger. Yeah. I thought it said hookers. <laughs> Ooh, we got a tunnel. Oh, don't look left. I looked left thinking there was a river or something down there, and it's probably down there, but it's down there. There it is. Oh, yeah. Wow. Jeep Town. Wow. Look at that thing. Oh yeah. Had a stretch for that shot. Wow. There's some stuff behind me. I can't get it though. Oh yeah. This is nice.
tunnel couldn't quite hit the gas as hard as I wanted to. <laughs> That's why they slowed us down. It's a tunnel, a, a curved tunnel. That was interesting. I was ready to hit the gas hard, but like, uh, maybe not. You got the outside, I got the inside. Did you like to stir? The audio is trying to keep up with this. I bet you could with all the drive. There's a black Audi behind us. You can to turn easier than us. Yeah. Brake check. Tick, tack, 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 tack. Use gears. Now you're recording. We gotta go slow down here. This must be a straight hill. This might be the summit. But what the hell? It looks like a scribble on that side. You see that? Hairpan curse. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of stuff. You are here. You will get down there. All right. Now I gotta go back to your side. That was an interesting sign. Fifth gear works pretty good on this. And there goes the Audi. Yep. And how do they plan to do this? So let's see how the Audi is uh, gonna get past bearded when there's no room in this little car over there. Yeah. Yeah, Beardy just said let him, so he keeps his uh, fairing intact. Seven percent grade for seven miles. He's shooting lower gears. Taking insights. I'd hate to get stuck out here overnight. Unless I had the right gear. Go, Audi, go. That's 45. Or if they check the brakes. It looks like they're braking. That's one five German machine. <laughs> nah. I could jump the hill, man. I could jump it. Trust me, I could jump it. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. We're still on the same hill from earlier, so this is going to take a while. I think we got, what, three or five miles left? Apparently we're... Oh, three miles to the hairpin, and we got like five, six miles. It was like seven miles total of downhill here. So we're probably coming from higher elevation, like over 10,000 down to, I don't know, three, four, something. Ooh, what's this? Trucks will flip over. That's good. Oh yeah, there's a hairpin. Look at that valley. Sweet. The things you can see on a motorcycle. A little different than a car. University. Another uh, truck, truck jump. Look at Bearded go, hanging some turns.
one's hanging to turn in a big SUV. Holy crap, that's where we came from. MotoGP. Ooh, watch out for that crack. And that one. It was through the turn. It's pretty back here. GoPro didn't listen to me and stuff. Uh, I'm not going to say it. It'll, it'll, it'll do something. But it's still recording. That's all I'll say. And it knew that this view was coming up. Yep. Oh, I can only turn so long, guys. 